For the second straight summer, Jacksonville State basketball has had a member of the team participate overseas international play. Last year it was Malcolm Drumright going to China and playing. This year, Christian Cunningham got the honor. Um, go back, season ends in March. We get back after the uh, CBI. And when did you find out that you were headed somewhere to play during the offseason? Uh, about a week after we came back from our little extended spring break, they probably grabbed me in the office. Uh, Coach Richardson, Coach Harper grabbed me and told me, uh, asked me if I wanted to go play in Belize. So while we're all sitting around here in the hot and humidity in Alabama, you're in Belize and enjoying the good life, I guess. Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, hot, humid, hot, hum hot and humid, just like that down uh, there. Yes, sir. Very hot. Uh, it was probably like 96 during the June time. All right, you had gone home to Albuquerque, and you left from there and gone, and you spent, what, a week, ten days over there? I probably spent about a month at home, uh, from Albuquerque to Houston and straight down to Belize. And ten days there playing and doing some sightseeing and some other things. Oh, uh, yes, I probably played about five games, uh, real good competition, uh, went up and down. Uh, then we went and saw some sites, saw some families, saw some children, did a lot of community work. When you weren't playing or, or practicing, you spent a lot of time with kids. Is that what it was? Uh, yes, sir. Was preaching with kids, uh, helping the community, uh, telling them about the Lord and God, just trying to be in the community, I guess. Um, you spent some time with families and, and people that uh, uh, I guess don't have as much as we do or a lot of us here in the States, right? Uh, yes, sir. Spent a lot of time with a family that lost their home, just had been a very bad financial situation. Uh, just sat, sat with them, prayed with them, hung out with them, talked to the kids, just made them feel different, made them feel better, had them have a different experience. And as you were telling me before we started this, I'm, I know Coach Harper's going to love this. You were actually swimming with sharks. Oh, yeah, we were swimming with the sharks. Uh, went scuba diving in some area in Belize uh, seas, swimming with the sharks, went snorkeling, saw some uh, stingrays. It was real fun. Had you been anywhere uh, tropical like that before? Uh, I'd been to Puerto Rico before, but not really out the country. But that was yeah. a definitely a great experience. What what did, what did you come back with from the experience? What did it teach you while you were gone? Uh, I'm truly blessed. I have a lot to be thankful for. I have a great home. I have a great school that I'm at right now. Uh, just a lot to be thankful for. And it was just a great experience overall. Now. Looking ahead to the season, hard to believe. This is it for you, your last year. Right, yes, sir. Fourth year. Uh, it's been a long time. I mean, this is day I, or year I've been looking forward to. I just got to have a great season to exceed all my expectations. Is it hard to believe, though, this is it, that it's four years and almost over? Right, very hard to believe. I mean, I still remember practices uh, with Coach Green, my very first coach at JSU. Uh, it's been a long road, had some great memories. Going back to my sophomore year NCAA tournament, I mean, this previous year didn't go as far as we expected, but still had a great outing, played in CBI, real fun. And you've come a long way, I think, in your four years here. It's been a good fit for you, hasn't it? Yes, sir. I loved my time here. It was a great experience. I have no complaints. <laughs> and a lot of people don't realize it, but you guys already working out and, and practicing uh, on your own and doing some things and getting ready for the season. So it never ends, does it? Yes, sir. Uh, we're always on the grind. I mean, they say it's the off season, but we're still working. Amen. Thank you. Uh, I know you had a great experience there. And, and uh, have you been able to share it with your teammates and, and talk to some other folks about it? Uh, I bring it up every once in a while. People ask where I was during that time. I tell them where I was, where I was at, what I was doing, just the whole concept of the trip and everything that happened. And looking forward to the new year, right? Uh, most definitely. Have a lot of big things coming up. <laughs> Amen. Thank you, sir. Good luck. Thank you.